mid lane and rocks because they just can't find any sort of fight. Oh, there's a flash in BDD. Wants to start this one off, but the Nether Grasp is actually going to be cancelled. There's a. Here comes Raven! Oh my god, the triple stun! Massive key burst, triple kill, quadra kill! Is this going to be the Penta? He's going to be delivered at this time! Penta That's kill! Gonna be the first Raven in three years, Penta kill for Khan! So and from this, especially with triple mountain drakes. Yeah, Zaya was exposed, Prey actually dies with his ultimate up. The Feather Storm wasn't even used in the fight, there's no peel for him as Khan wants to turn around to kill. Yeah, looks for it. Actually does a decent job there on the fake of the flash. Oh my god, finds the weak point now. Wolf, he's in trouble. The double kill for Khan. And he'll now go back to base. They'll lose a turret. But that was a beautiful play. Yeah, he does clean up. He's going to have to recall right now. Yeah, I don't think they can lose three inhibitors. That's going to be too big. Nice cleanse there from the... Whoa. Bang. Okay, coming on in. What? And Ian is going to be knocked over a wall by did, a wall. Did that... <laughs> what? That's all the injury. That... Double kill for Ixu. Can Penta. he make it a triple? Well, this looks like the triple. Will Give they Penta. get the other? There's the mischain of corruption going in is Ixu. And the hook, the hook, will they give it over? There's the quad kill going for crowd. Will we see the Penta? Yeah! Penta kill for Akali in this game. And Ixu showing up like a beast. Is gonna take the pen beside me to be used to actually give him an escape when his flash was down. So finally a successful pick. Even though it's only Tucson, SKT have to start the Baron. But there's a nice cheeky ward here that does give them extra information. Well, I don't know whether there is enough information actually. Especially is. if it's a two-man. If they can just two-man this all the way down, it is actually out of vision of the ward. Yeah, and Blossom seems to be able to tank this up they for long enough. They yeah, know it now, now they're gonna be able to find it, but it's all too late. It's gonna be taken out. SKT all in on this one. Elder will be done. The Baron speed not fantastic for a Freaker, but not zero this late in the game. Yeah, it's going down pretty damn quickly as there's the teleport in from Tal. Okay, fair bit of damage now as well as he really wants to find this. Where's the wall? Rush. There it is, he five damage. Good God, the damage from this cannon. Instant double kill. He'll be able to get a third now as effort turns up and blank. Can he land this ultimate? Yes, he can. See you later, King. Oh, oh. He's looking to get more aggressive now with that blue. Oh, chains coming in. Uh, on fleek. Oh, it's boy. The other way. The bait is coming in oh with the barrier. He misses God. it. And the follow up with the dash. Tovi follows up, picks up the kill. And the gold lead still very significant. But we'll go ahead and get another look at this. Watch the replay here. Lava ups into a 1v1 against his old teammate, outplayed by Faker. Excellent flash to confirm the Q hitting. Walks away and. He would have preferred so, just to clear it for a duo. Yeah, exactly right. You're not going to wash that one off. So really unfortunate stuff for Zenit. You could imagine he's definitely kicking himself at this point. This uh, replay is going to continue. Picture Omti in picture. goes for a pick onto Zillion, I guess, with ultimate up and then dies to the Urgot TP. So yeah. that's not a rookie mistake. That's a, unfortunately, brazen mistake coming through from Umti. Looks and like Tilt to so me to be far. Won't be the same after he picks up that wave, but now trying to get on top of Toby here. And is gonna land, but he does have cleanse and even flashes away from that one. Follow up trouble bubble. Oh. Trying to get nasty here. Nearly gets him a flashes in for the kill. First blood goes to Toby, but has he oh. gone too far? No! The miss is Toby is gonna sidestep and Umpty goes down Toby. What a madman. Give oh, this man dude. the full back in the mid lane. 19 farms, so there has been some CSing happening lane but yeah largely being avoided by pawn pawn picked up most of it beforehand is the chain mm -hmm. it's going to activate yet again we get a mimic to one as Two well chains. Pop, and that's the solo kill pawn he's someone oh, skt wards coming down looking for an entry and effort might have found it pops up to ambition gonna go ahead try to get his way out of there finger goes in for the taunt just as punch connects in ambition goes low and he's gonna die Watch out. Finger goes golden but he'll get taken down but now bang is into the back but he's isolated himself he finishes up one and gets all of them triple kill bang are you kidding me insane play from him he manages flash to stay available but already the fast body slam he's waiting for the flash here out of khan to put that cast but he puts it down and now khan is all alone 1v2 Trying to hop on over with that flash and with the slow, he make it away, but here comes Pawn. They're looking for the dive. Three members trying to go under this turret. There's the flash stun. There's the burst damage, but Whoa! slow! He gets killed under the turret! Now no way! Force the flash away, and Khan gets away! What the hell? How did
and he just win 1v3. Oh, it's very strong lane, it's not working. It's in the well, middle. Yeah, Riftor comes in and Trick just picks it up. The coolest game of tennis I've seen for a long time, and that's first blood. That was oh, really looking for the Arctic assault. They're under the turret now as Devour is gonna spit out sword. Oh. It's a lower cooldown. It's oh my god, the damage onto you, Cal, and Chovy gets out once again. Jeff yes. is excited, flashes, gets the second into the third. No, Viper. and Viper's popping off in the back line. This is a Kaiser that shouldn't be this strong yet, but he is. He's able to do it. Can he get the fourth? Oh, it's so close to the quadrant. The Kellen. answer is still no. We get the replay here. Fly opens up a big effective health lead by hitting everything at the start, but actually closing the kill off the stasis. It proved impossible. It's about 500 health on Pyrian. Let's watch the burst here. Never move Q ult is the better part so smart. of 1300 this tankiness is once again ambition. He just does it again. He tries to go in there. He's going to be locked down, but Max is going to be destroyed by Ruler. Cortez makes it out of there as Re -engage. well. This time Ruler has so much room, but they're going to take out Crown. They're going to win. Pilot in the back line is just mowing them down. A triple kill for this Caitlyn, and they're looking for more. The Quadra, he wants the Penta. Can he get it? He's going to snipe them down, but oh! no, it's not the Penta somehow the most thing about it they're trying ADD he's got to go forward he's got to be the man there it is Zaya at 23 minutes but Han will live they're actually just teleporting in melee range to fake that they've started the Baron and looking for a pick well, they're going to find the trouble bubble as Cannon Barrage actually just to scout the pit. That's not going to be useful now against Soan, who's even going to get picked off. Sangyu taking a lot of damage here as there is at least something, but oh, that shockwave only under two members. And Jin Air will need to back away. Their pirate dead and Nova coming from, from base. Tarzan as in goes the hands. Gets the quickness as Viper right into the back line. Key's going to be taken out, but Sangyun was the first to go down. Stopwatches are not going to be able to stop this onslaught as Lava is picked off. We're looking for the Pentakill. That's it for Viper. Pentakill for Viper. Doesn't need an awesome dude, does it anyway? Frontlining on Kaiser and Griffin and wins the game. Now, actually, the lane is going to meet right in the middle. So not going to push too far forward for Faker, but there's the flash and the ultimate. First blood going over to Faker. Immediately does cleanse. And wow, Mickey was just not expecting here with the Abyssal Voyage. Yeah, oh, Barrel yeah. gets the taunt. It's on to Teddy. He doesn't have QSS, but gets himself out of the way. It's a decent exhaust on a showmaker who doesn't have Emo Blake. They've certainly pulled off this one as Seraph's Embrace finally oh. completed. Canyon in trouble. Teddy kiting. Time. Can he actually find this team fight? If oh. Barrel Shock Blast grabs the Vladimir, that is so much damage missing from the fight now as Khan grabs that first kill, grabs the second. Canyon so low, Barrel so low. Canyon picks up the kill on Amada there, but that's the triple kill now for Khan. Hero's entrance comes down, and Teddy grabs that one. SKT finesse in the team fight to save the game. And that was one of the best jugglings I've ever seen in LCK. The fight, the and this is Teddy saying it's time for the go button. And the fact that Vladimir is out of the fight, no value out of a bajillion gold on Vladimir. No longer is it Sivir and Vlad as best friends, and this is what was on the top of the screen. Oh, BDD no. fails his claw, flashes out, and Clint says, hey, I'm battle ready. I've got the Elder Dragon double buff here and able to chase down. BDD this never ults. A bit too emba emblazoned under the turret. Yeah, they managed to get this inhibitor turret most likely as well as the siege minion is going to be down, Chobi. Has a oh lot of sneakiness, God. diving on forward, and Bono didn't last um, a couple of seconds. He's going 1v4. Lava's going to be the first one to go down. Flashes out the way. is going to be tagged up, but no backflip going to be reactivated. And Chovy, the two for nothing 1v4. Maybe the Irelia and the Carly. himself safe with the cleanse. The members of Gen G solo. The piercing arrow from Teddy flies straight and true. Finds the hit on the crown and takes him down. TP coming in, so on, looking for a oh! play. And Teddy gets the two for one special. Triple kill in the end, going over to him and Jin Air. Shot. We finally get the confirmation here. Khan is just trying to play halfway down the lane. Gets hit by everything. Doesn't even get hit by everything. I'm trying to predict what happened because of the health bars. But it's an extended trade. It looks like it's all going to be even Ooh. between the two. But actually oh, just gets so hit, good. doesn't flash, and his damage calculation is on. So wow, Khan just completely outplayed in the 1v1 by Keen. A straight up solo kill. It's a little bit out of spot. He's not close enough to stop this, I don't think. So much secure. Okay, there it is. The beast comes in, and here comes Fem, the five man oh! ultimate.
so much damage in the front line. Unbelievable. The Baron goes to Hanwell the four kills. Go to KT, the triple kill for Smith. The Lissandro ultimate to secure that kill. They're going to trade one for one. Nice W from Mickey, though. Sets up the double kill. He finally goes down, but it will be another one for Lyra in the end. Maybe Tom Kench. Oh, Ambition wow. turns it around. Got it. And now he's going to try to get away, but that's going to be tough. Nope. All right, he's just going to recall. Snowflower.